I need to find the sacred relic. Or whatever. Yeah, we'll go with that. I better take this bow for safety. No, take it. God. Oh, oh no, a skeleton. Uh-oh. Better hide somewhere, but I don't have any arrows. Oh, I, maybe I should grab the one that he has right here. Thank you. Yay! Wow. How, what a cool thing. I wonder how I'm taking these arrows from the wall. Gosh, I guess you can find out in this video. Yeah. He's... You just die already? <laughs> hey, what's going on guys? Like that zip here and welcome back to another Minecraft Redstone video. In today's video, we're gonna be discussing a way for you to use the command blocks in Minecraft to make these guys some of the most useful mobs you could ever possibly imagine having. It makes the arrows that they shoot at you grabbable and usable for your own ammo. So it's actually a really easy redstone trick, and if you want to see more videos like this, make sure you drop a like on the video. It lets me know that you want to see more redstone tutorials like this. But this one comes to you courtesy of the Farlander, so make sure you check out their channel as well, and we will get right into it. So let me go ahead and switch into game mode zero really quick. We've got a our little specimen over here. I'm going to have him try and fire some arrows at me. Hopefully he doesn't kill me. So game mode zero. So he, he's got my attention. Let him shoot at me a couple times. So we got an arrow there. And what I'm going to do is look. I'm going to stand right by it. And voila. I actually grabbed the arrow. And it works for all of his arrows. So if you want to just do some target practice. Set up a skeleton like this for an arrow collecting farm. That is something you could very easily do with this redstone. It's um, I'll actually explain how it goes right now. Uh, ah, don't hit me like that. <laughs> So what it is is when an arrow, when a skeleton fires off an arrow, that arrow counts as an entity, and the entity will get stuck in blocks or whatever it is. You gotta be, you gotta be like right next to it in order to pick it up. It's part of the. But anyways, the point is, uh, these entities are separate from the normal firing entities that you usually get when you fire off arrows. And the reason for this is so that Minecraft doesn't give you normally the arrows that these skeletons fire off. So what we have over here is a set of command blocks. These top and bottom ones, they simply are just replacing this redstone block over and over again, so it's setting these off constantly. Now the first block over here is actually going to be giving, it's, uh, it's giving the entities that are being fired by the skeletons a certain score type, and this is going to be called in-ground score, and what it is doing is constantly adding a score of one to all of the arrow entities. And then what this does is the moment it hits uh, entity nine, so once it hits a minimum of nine, it will give your player, assuming you're next to the arrow, a single arrow. So it'll add one arrow to your inventory like we were having before. And then this final block is when it sets that arrow score gets to 10, it actually deletes the arrow. So it kind of, uh, it creates the illusion that you're picking up the arrow. What's really happening is he's firing it right as you stand right next to it you get a new arrow and then it deletes that one so it just kind of it makes it seem like you pick it up but it's not actually and you actually configure the amount of time it takes for that to work if we set this to eight and you set the other one to nine it will cause the arrow to be grabbed faster but nine seems to be the prime level for setting it in terms of making it realistic with grabbing the arrow unfortunately it is pretty exploitable as you can see here we have uh well <laughs> We did have an infinity bow, but that's okay because we can just make another one really quick. Um, where is combat? Infinity one and a bow. You can actually use these with infinity bows, unfortunately, so let me go ahead and enchant this really quick. Because these infinity bows, they use the same type of arrow entity as these skeleton ones do. So we will just take one arrow and we'll switch back to game mode zero and you'll be able to see in just a second here. So we can just keep firing, keep firing, keep firing, keep firing, and what will happen is I'll stand by all these and I will pick them all up. So it is it is abusable, but um, something like this is obviously better suited for maybe some kind of redstone adventure map where you know you can kind of control the types of items that players are given, not just you know just give. Ah oh, man, I kind of wanted him to kill me. <laughs> but either way, guys, that is the redstone video. It's short, quick, and simple and easy. And if you again, if you want to see more redstone videos like this, make sure you leave a like on the video. I'm only gonna do it if you guys want to see it. And of course, check out the Farlanders in the description and uh, let me know if. Uh, you have any other tips or cool applicable users that you use this redstone trick for but that's about it guys i hope you enjoyed and we will catch you next time thanks